Good morning and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome back to my Melody's Kitchen World. We are cooking. What we are cooking right now? Chili. Homemade chili. We are cooking homemade chili. Homemade chili for lunch, guys. So. So ang gagamitin namin ngayon, guys, na ingredients. Meron kaming um. So, let's get started! Pero hindi ako marunong magloto. Si husband. Si husband lang ang magloto. Magano lang ako dito guys. Um, Magsamuk-samuk ako sa iyang loto. So, meron tayong ano dito. Yan. Um, ground pork. 80-20. Yung ano niya. Meron tayong onions dito. Meron tayong original. Hey, Mouse here. Gonna do some cooking. Okay. Yan. Yeah, ito siya, guys. So, diced tomatoes and green chilies. Rutel. Yan. Yeah, ito yung panghalo ng ano, chili. Ito ba yun? Hindi ko alam. I don't know. So, I'll be my husband's cameraman today. For three years, she's still well, allowed to cook. While he's cooking. So, okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to heat this pan up to 275 degrees. I'm going to put my hamburger in there to get it browned. Normally when I make chili, it's pretty plain. Um, I just brown the meat, cut up an onion and put in it, tomato juice, salt and pepper, and that's it. And uh, kidney beans. But today I'm going to uh, spice it up a little bit. I'm going to use more and different spices and um, see how it comes out. Because I'm getting uh, tired of the, of the kidney beans. The kidney beans are not to my taste anymore. As you age, when, when you're younger, middle age, your, your, your palate changes. Well, we'll see. We'll taste it at the end here and, and see if it needs the beans. Use this one, honey. Use that one, honey. This hamburger, when you brown it, this is not like frying a hamburger. You don't want to get a crust on it, you just want to brown it. Cook some of the grease out of it. So you don't need it up way high. This is two pounds of hamburger. Just chop, just breaking it up a little bit. Get it ready to brown. After I break it up, I'll, uh, I'll chop up an onion and put it in there. Get a little bit of a sweat on the onion. And then when it's uh, fully browned, I'll uh, drain most of the grease off. Normally, I, you know, I, I'll, uh, I'll dump this hamburger in a colander or a stringer, and then I'll run hot water over it and get all the grease off of it, and I think that take some of the flavor away from the hamburger and I'm not going to do that anymore. Because the grease is flavor. And if you get rid of all of it, you're, you're losing all of that flavor. And I don't want to do that. Again, this is an experiment. See how it turns out. Okay, I've got this broken up. This is my vegetable chopper. And it's plenty sharp. For this onion, you don't need to really be chop it fine or anything like that. Uh, you can leave it in bigger pieces. Because this chili is going to be cooking for two or two and a half hours. Yan guys, magluluto kami ng pagkain ni Mr. This is how he cooked his uh, chili, guys. Now you see that the grease is forming, and you don't want it all. But I think the, the grease that's on the meat, you should have it on the meat. It gives you some flavor. 
Now I'm going to be using some spices that I normally have never used for chili. I'm going to be using granulated garlic, black pepper. I'm going to be using a little bit of cayenne pepper. I'm going to be using some chili powder and a little bit of oregano and some of the seasoning salt. And I'm also going to use a couple of tubes of this beef bouillon. Chili powder. A little bit of oregano. And some uh, uh, beef bouillon tubes. It's getting browny now. Almost. Getting close. You want to chop up this ham hamburger meat in uh, uh, small pieces as you can get it. This is 80 meat with 20% fat. They call it 80-20. For hamburger, chili, and most anything you need uh, a hamburger with, 80-20 will do you good. It's, it's actually made from chuck. So this is ground chuck. This is the pot I'm going to cook in. And I'm going to put this meat Normally I would use two full bottles of this tomato juice for the chili that I used to make. For this recipe I'm only going to put a half of one. Tomato juice in. Now I'm going to put this Rotel diced tomatoes with green chilies. This will give it some flavor and also a little bit of heat with the green chilies. I'm going to bring this up to a boil and then I'm going to turn it down to a simmer and uh, add spices. Okay, bouillon cube made by Weilers. Give it more of a beef flavor. Two cups of water. Approximately. Doesn't have, doesn't have to be exact. Gotta bring it up to a boil. Here's the update guys for my husband's chili. It's a slow boil. And it'll start breaking down these little uh, tomato bits. Stir it up real good. Got the granulated garlic. Black pepper. Black pepper, okay. One teaspoon. Mm -hmm. Chili powder. Chili. Two tablespoons. Is that spicy or no? <coughs> Not much. Not no, much. no red pepper. One teaspoon salt. Meat tenderizer. The cumin will go in in the second round. So right now I'm going to put this in. Mix it all together. There you go. Smells so good. Now the bad thing about these precision induction cooktops, I want to turn this down to a simmer, a low simmer. So I'm going to start here and then I'm going to take it down little by little, down to about 230. And that should keep it right at, that's a little bit above uh, the boiling point of water. So you can, you can see in there that it's just barely at a simmer. And now I'm going to set the, I'm going to set the timer to one hour. And I'll be back in one hour to add more spices and give it a stir. I'll be stirring it a little bit, you know, about every 10 or 15 minutes. Um, so we'll, we'll be back in one hour. Okay, see you guys in one hour.
Hi, we're back. It's been an hour. Um, the chili has been simmering for an hour. And it's time to put the, the second round of uh, spices in it. Over here, you can see I got the spices. This is cayenne pepper, one teaspoon. One tablespoon of granulated garlic. Teaspoon of black pepper. Teaspoon of cumin. A tablespoon of uh, chili powder. The uh, meat t uh, tenderizer. And this is oregano. So I'm going to dump this in. And this is just, this just layers the flavors. It takes a while for these spices to cook out because you don't want them, you don't want the spices to take like taste like raw spices so they gotta cook. Stir these in real good. Also there was another teaspoon of salt. And while I was gone I put two more cups of water and the rest of that uh, tomato juice in here. Because it just wasn't looking like um, the chili. That, that I normally cook, plus it seemed like a lot of spices. So I thought a little bit more liquid would kind of ease up on the spices a little bit. Now that I got this stirred up, it's, it's going to simmer again for another half an hour, and then after that we'll taste it. Then, guys, after mag antayin natin ang ating minutes ito. Yun yung ano niya, guys. Um, experiment niya sa chili sa chili ni Mr. Nag-experiment siya kung paano niya lulutuin ng mas masarap ang kanyang chili. Yan guys, kain tayo nito nga nung si Charol. Habang nagluluto guys, kain tayo. Yan, si Charol. Mm. My husband cooking his own chili version. Yan habang naghintay tayo. Ayan, kain tayo. <laughs> Ang sarap na ito ba? Maanghang na... Maanghang na medyo matamis-tamis. Ano siya? Barbecue flavor. Barbecue flavor. Uh, so, ayan guys. Magluto din tayo ng rice. Mag-rice tayo. Rice is live. Diba guys? Guys, meron tayong shoe Meron tayong shoe pao dito. Kainin natin breakfast. Shoe pao talaga. Shoe pao talaga. So, yeah. Lapit-lapit na rin. So, kakainin natin yung ano, shoe pao. Shoe pao and coffee. Magko-coffee tayo ngayon. Hi, guys! Ito na, guys. Oh. Samok na yung lamisang gamay. Ay, yan, guys. Oh. Siupaw. Tsaka magkakapi din tayo. Magkakapi tayo. Kapi, kapi, kapi. Kapi and yung ano natin, yung um, siupaw. Ayan. I got this from um, from Ate Marlene, my boss. So, Ate Marlene, thank you for the shupaw. Masarap, te. Ayan na, guys. Ito yung coffee natin. Meron akong malaking jar dito na, no, coffee mate. Tsaka yung kape. Ano lang. Hindi ako mahiling sa coffee, guys, pero mag-coffee tayo. Hindi ako. Minsan-minsan lang ako nagkakape, guys, pag gusto ko lang. Pero pag, ah, hindi. May mga panahon kasi na gusto kong magkapi. Wala na akong asukan. Ay! Ubus na yung asukan ko pala. Atong na na guys, ubus na yung white sugar. Ayan. Meron naman akong brown sugar. Pero ubus, ubusin na natin itong white Ayan na guys. Ito yung ano ko guys. Um, breakfast. This is my breakfast. Ayan na siya. 
Mister Kapit. Naka tinigil lang si Mister. How's your cooking there? Ito guys, masarap to pang snacks. Kapag nasa trabaho kayo, ito yung ano yung snacks. It's big. Masarap ng ano, ang daming ano, laman siya. Ayan guys. Ito na yung pangalawa. Okay guys, that's it for today. Thank you for watching.